name is Taisha Travis and I am with the Bereavement Department here at Community Hospice. And today I wanted to talk to you a little bit about um, poetry. I wanted to go ahead and share um, how to make and create a poem for those days when we're feeling really stressed out or really overwhelmed or even when our emotions are a little high and we want to be able to express ourselves and get them out or even on those days that our imagination and creativity are just kind of booming and buzzing and we want to you know find ways to get those out too so I want to go ahead and show you how to create an I am poem so for our I am poem all you need are going to be paper or something to write with or even if you want to use a computer um, for a word document just anything that you can write with um, even if you want to do a voice memo um, and, and make a poem in that way so today we're going to be using our paper and we're gonna start with our sentence starters. So for the I am poem, this poem is going to be how we express ourselves. So an I am poem is really good for when you wanna introduce yourself to someone new, or when you want to reintroduce yourself, because um, maybe some things about you have changed. So the I am poem is all about you. So the first sentence starter we have for the I am poem is I am, and you wanna go ahead and name two special characteristics about yourself. So any kind of adjective that describe who you are. And second, we're going to say, I wonder. So something that you're curious about or something that you have a question about. I hear. So something that you hear or even something that you imagine that you hear. I see, I want, so something that you want, something that you wish for. I pretend, so something that's imaginary or something that you just pretend to do or have. I feel. So just write down something that you feel, an emotion. And I choose. Something that you choose. And I worry. So something that you worry about or something that's maybe on your mind that's causing you a little bit of stress. I understand. So think of something that you understand or something that you have knowledge about or answers to. I say. So what do you say? What do you say to yourself? What do you say to other people? So write down something that you say. I try. So again, something that you try to do um, even if it's something that you haven't done in a long time or something that you've never tried to do, something that you want to try to do. I remember. So write, write down something that you remember or something that you have a memory of. It can be recent or it can be something that's happened years ago. I dream. So this can be something that you literally dreamt about last night or something that you dream of in the future. I hope. So you wanna write down here something that you hope for. And lastly, one more time, I am. So again, some special characteristics and special traits that you have that you wanna share. And as an example, I want to share with you my own I Am poem. Um, and I hope that when you're done with your poem, you can also go ahead and type it up or write it up and you can laminate it and post it in your home um, or you can just keep it and, and put it in a photo album or something special that you wanna do with your completed I Am poem. So with mine, I got, went ahead and laminated it and I'll share my poem with you today. I wrote, I am accepting and patient I wonder about the future. I hear people outside laughing. I see cows outside my bedroom window. I want to be heard. 
I pretend to have magic. I feel the wind around me. I choose to be positive. I worry about getting older. I understand the vastness of the universe. I say things that help people. I try to help others to the best of my ability. I remember most things my parents tell me. I dream of writing a book. I hope to visit my family soon and I am accepting and patient. There's no right or wrong way to make your poem. This is completely self-expression up to you. So make sure to do your best and be open and share your poem with those that want to see or those that you're just really, like I said, want to introduce yourself to the world and, and share who you are. Maybe some new things that you've learned about yourself. So just take your time and enjoy and have fun. And like I said, please remember that we can type this up and share this and post it on our fridge or post it um, in an email and share it um, 